Hi, Chris Chanock here at Display Week 2023. I'm in the JBD, Jade Bird Display booth, where they're showing their uh, micro LED solutions. Uh, so, Jade Bird has uh, developed uh, uh, some of the most uh, efficient and, and commercially available micro LEDs on the market. They make red, green, and blue. Uh, discrete devices and they can put them together in this little tiny projector um, uh, here's there's my finger for perspective there this is 0.4 cc uh, and it's uh, you take the three discrete uh, devices and put them in a, a cube combiner with a tiny little lens uh, and this can go into glasses uh, that are obviously very small kind of design here that light's a little, little bright to see. We'll see this, uh, but yeah, you can see this is this is their new reference design uh, for for AR glasses. And I'll try and get an image here. Uh, but they they you know there's the uh, the hummingbird. It's a little bright here, um, but they um, they use gallium gallium nitride for the blue and the green, and indium gallium indium gallium phosphide. Um, Aluminum, aluminum <laughs> phosphide uh, for the red. Uh, so they, they're now in, in commercial production of these. They have a new facility uh, in China, factory to uh, to go into to scale up uh, production. Uh, and on the roadmap, uh, they've got some few things in development. Well, one thing in particular, they're talking about a 2K by 2K device that would use, uh, I think they said, uh, two, about a two to two and a half micron pixel pitch, uh, which means it's a one micron sized device. Uh, that is really tiny and state of the art. Uh, they say they have made them at that size, um, but who knows what the efficiency is going to be at, at that size and or the yield at that size. Um, but it's also gonna be another two years before this is, uh, commercially available so kind of a long-term uh, play right now they're waiting for the market to be there um, now that may change uh, if and when Apple launches their AR headset which is rumored to be 4k by 4k uh, per eye so we shall see Chris Jenock here